Hello, Doug here, and today we're going to talk about selective color, and this is for uh, helping narrowband images with the overpowering green. This tutorial I found was at Bob Frank's uh, website, it's at bfastro.com, and there are four selective color steps that will help your green narrowband images become uh, more uh, colorful. As you know, the Hubble palette is comprised of the the S2 is red, HA is green, and O3 is blue. And sometimes the the HA channel can be very overpowering, and the whole image looks just green from head to toe. And with these steps, you can give it uh, a, a the image a much better appearance. Again, Bob Frank's website is at bfastro.com. Here you can see this tutorial in its written format and the steps that I'm outlining here for you today. The uh, image today was uh, courtesy of Jim White. Jim White has uh, allowed me to use one of his images to show you today in Photoshop. Okay, so now in Photoshop, let's take this image and make a duplicate of it first and what we'll do is four iterations of selective color. We go to image, adjustment, selective color. And the first one we use is the greens. Select the greens and we're going to take the cyan and make it minus 100 and the magenta minus 25. Sometimes it's hard to hit it with the mouse by dragging it, so you can use the up and down arrows to get you to the correct uh, level you need. You say OK. That's the first one. Image, Adjustments, Selective Color, and this time we're going to do the yellows. We hit yellows, and the yellows, you take the cyan and make it minus 100, and magenta plus 25 say OK. Again, image, adjustment, selective color, and this time we're going to do the cyans. We're going to go to here, and we're going to do minus 1, then take the yellow and go minus 100. As you can see, the image is already starting to take on a, a dramatic uh, difference in what we started with. We still have one more iteration here to go, so we'll go Image, Adjustment, Selective Color. Again, we do the cyans. And this time we're going to do the magenta, minus 25. And we're going to take the yellow to minus 100. And we're going to say OK. Okay, now this has changed the image dramatically from what we started. Here was this green image that we had of narrowband imaging, and then after we applied uh, the uh, selective color technique to it, it has changed it dramatically. We've got blues, golds, yellows, uh, a very nice uh, colorful image after the adjustments before and after. One last thing I'd like you to, to remind you about is that you can win a coffee mug with your winning image if you uh, enter the monthly contest at uh, myastroimages.com. If your uh, image is selected as one of the winning images, it will be entered into the quarterly contest where you will then be uh, up for uh, uh, a chance to win a coffee mug. Thanks for watching this tutorial and we'll see you soon. Thanks.